photographer and makeup artist or the team. Advice, and not the calm advice. Fox the song of sacrifice. The act of rolling dice is rolling out to act it nice. Now I got an active wife who always gotta ask me twice. No. Put that task on ice, gasping at this fascist price. They try to fasten rights, all you hear my cat. Maybe I'll 
So it has been a week since our photo shoot. I just kind of edited the video and realized that I don't actually have a proper outro. We finished our 5 hour photo shoot at about 3 p.m. that day, packed, tidied up and basically headed off to dinner. We had so much fun. Brian surprisingly really enjoyed it as well. It didn't really felt like a tiring or exhausting day where our faces would be aching from smiling too hard at all. The day honestly just flew by. As you would have seen from the clips, we also got to shoot some snippets around the hotel and in our room. Obviously, we have to give our photographer Vegas and his partner slash makeup and hairstylist Alice all of the credit for making us feeling so comfortable but at the same time looking sharp as they are a couple as well, Hong Kongers in the UK. I think they are quite similar age to us, but yeah, they really made this experience enjoyable and memorable. So if you're looking for a photographer or a makeup artist, I'll be sure to include their contact information down below. They do UK and destination as well. Also, a huge shout out to my brother for tagging along that day. He spent the whole day with us. All the behind the scenes are shot by him. He also helped film some IG videos and helped with a lot of logistics like ordering our car, finding our car, charging our phones, making the day seamless and the memories that he captured for us like this is just our pre-wedding or engagement photo shoot but I feel like it is already one for the books. I'm so thankful that he offered to capture these memories for us. It just gave us so much more to look back on capturing how the day went how fun it was and brought this experience to a whole new level. So let's give my brother a round of applause. <laughs> I was also so pleased to have created the two bouquets myself. I would love to show you guys the progress but I haven't edited those clips yet. I love the abundance and basically went all out for my very first bouquet, incorporating beautiful seasonal peonies, garden roses with fillers like Olaya Grandiflora's, Astrangias, and still be in love. I guess it was worth all the stress and prep behind it. I couldn't really get over my second bouquet either. Honestly, it was one of the few creations that I truly will miss. It was a pair of beautiful architectural white ethereums, which are eye-wateringly expensive, paired with gestural dried white Italian ruskets, grasses, eustomas, or more commonly known as lithiansis. I love that I was able to add my personal touch to not just the looks, but the florals as well. I feel like this overall experience has been surreal. Almost felt like a wedding day preview or rehearsal. I cannot wait to see the rest of the photos, get them printed, framed, and everything. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. We are less than four months away from our actual wedding day. We are going for our pre-wedding honeymoon in about two months time. But for now, I shall see you guys in my next one. Take care guys, bye.